going to expel? Yeah, you can say that, of course, you know. Uh, we're starting every game, you know, to, uh, to try to get points, uh, to win games. Every game is, is going to be uh, the same, you know, when, when we start. And, of course, this is very disappointed for everybody who loves Crystal Palace. Uh, you want to get off the mark, of course, uh, you get uh, some goals. Uh, on the table and, and points, and uh, we didn't achieve it. So it's very disappointing for uh, for everybody. Especially first half, didn't show any courage on the ball. You know, there were a, lo a lot of moments that we could really play, uh, you know, on the ground, and there was no moment that we looking to feel comf uh, comfortable on, on the ball and. I cannot say that uh, was uh, because Swansea did a fantastic job. It wasn't because we, there were two teams, I think, yeah, didn't play uh, their best. And it was a game, of course, if they play also 5-3-2, and we play 5-3-2, then it's normally they have one spare man left uh, in the back and we have one spare man left in, in the back. So that means that it, you're going to have a lot of duels. Uh, and the team who makes the less mistakes win this uh, kind of games. And <coughs> that you saw the, the first half, I think, and also, of course, the second half, uh, you know, we lose in, in three minutes, you know, we gave the, the, the game away. Uh, I think uh, we could have done better with uh, both uh, goals. And but the most... Uh, Thing I'm disappointed that we didn't show the courage. And after 2 0, I saw the courage. And then you see a whole different uh, Crystal Palace. And, and this is the Crystal Palace that I want to see. And then we created our chances. They didn't create anyone anymore. Uh, and yeah, that you have to do from, from the start. And uh, so I'm very disappointed in our, especially our first half. It looks like uh, confident because what I already said, uh, if you have, uh, there is no pressure on the ball, uh, yeah, then, then you have to put it uh, to the right color. And, and with a lot of times we, we didn't, or we, we turned and we didn't uh, have no knowledge where the, the opponent was at that moment. Uh, so there were so many moments to, to hurt them, in my point of view, uh, Swansea, but yeah, we didn't succeed at in the first half. And, the second half, again, uh, again, we did that uh, much better. Frank, uh, obviously the fans that showed you the first bit, you played a little bit half fun and full time. Can you understand that frustration? Uh, we, I always, f uh, I'm also frustrated and uh, I can understand that also the, the fans are frustrated because they want to see uh, points, uh, they want to see goals and uh, so they are not spoiled uh, right now. Yeah, I cannot give uh, yeah, any update right now. Uh, of course, he's a robust player, and yeah, we don't know. But you know, the, if you if you miss uh, miss Ruben and 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 Wilf, you know, our, you know, Ruben were, was two times I think one of the best players in our squad the last uh, two games, and if you, and then also uh, Wilf, who was you know maybe the most impressive player of the the preseason, and you miss two of those players, yeah. That's uh, yeah. Then you miss really something, and uh, so yeah. Hopefully they come and come uh, come back uh, to Burnley, but I have no clue right now how long it really takes. Uh, Wolf is just in the beginning, you know, to to really start up uh, uh, the the recovery, the rehab, and I don't know. Normally they say it always goes very fast with him, but so we have to have to wait and. I'm positive uh, about Ruben, but uh, hopefully you don't get a, a setback. Frank, does the international break come at the right time for you? You really watched that many Philippe games and you agreed? Yeah, I cannot say, you know, uh, we are in a very good situation right now. So I think, of course, right now it is the best uh, thing to have, to have, you know, two weeks to train to get uh, everybody fresh in the head again uh, and go for, for Burnley. And 
So yeah, I'm uh, very happy that now the international break is there. And I can imagine uh, for Huddersfield Town right now, who's top of the league, they say, yeah, we want to play uh, Wednesday again. Yeah, that's normal. And uh, so hopefully uh, we can turn it around and, uh, in those two weeks and uh, yeah, get on the leaderboard. Yes, no, yeah, that's the only thing you can uh, can say that d if you are afraid or uh, you don't show courage, yeah, you never get uh, what you get. And uh, if you show courage, then you will see you create much and much more. And that belief they have to have to see. And we're going to show that, we're going to uh, analyze that uh, with our players. And so hopefully they can understand. Uh, yeah, uh, we have to show it every game, and uh, in what kind of system uh, we play. Uh, it always depends, you know, how the opponent play. Will they press? Okay, yeah. Then you have to play much far, uh, faster, the longer ball. But if they don't press, yeah, just play on, on the ground. And after the 2-0, we did it. And yeah, this is uh, again that the Crystal Palace I, I want to see. Thank you very much. We'll do the daily newspapers.